will this impact the mayor's much touted transit plan? She has made numerous appearances supporting Nashville Transit, which would bring the city's first ever light rail. As News Channel 5's Kyle Horan has learned, sponsors of the transit ordinance have taken up the cause. They say there will be no delay in tomorrow's final vote. Kyle. Yeah. And I know that because I talked to multiple council members since last week. They all said the same thing. There's no plans to stop a vote that could change Nashville forever. Now, one of those people that I talked to is council member Kathleen Murphy. She's a co-sponsor of the bill and she says it's still a go. We've done story after story about Nashville's transit plan. Transit, we're all excited about transit. Many of which were on Mayor Megan Barry proudly hoisting the light rail and bus service banner. She led the charge, some would say, on a transit plan that promises to change the face of Nashville forever. And I have heard a lot of people. But does the cloud of scandal hang over the path to the future? Metro Council member Kathleen Murphy says, no way. What happened last week does not affect the plan that we've been discussing. Murphy is a sponsor of this ordinance. This traffic is not the traffic that, that we had when I was a child, and, and we've got to do something about it, and that time is now. She has heard the rumors. Opponents have speculated a loss of the mayor's popular presence over the transit plan could stop it in its tracks. I think that a lot of people are speculating on a lot of different things this week and last week, but at the end of the day, this plan for transit has not changed. It's the plan that we have been discuss discussing for weeks and months. Um, I've been hearing from constituents about traffic issues for years at this point, and it's time to move forward. Murphy believes the transit plan will pass tomorrow, sending the final decision to voters in May. I think that it's time for us to put it on the ballot and, and let our voters decide because this plan is it's not about the Metro Council, it's not about Mayor Barry, it's about getting our constituents out of gridlock and getting them back to the things that they care about, like spending time with their family or getting to a show downtown without spending half an hour extra in traffic just staring at bumper to bumper traffic. Now to pass that needs 21 yes votes. The ordinance has 25 sponsors. Reporting live in Nashville, Kyle Horan, News Channel 5.